time to go in for uh, the announcement of next round of uh, Scotch Order of Merit. So please stay with me. May I invite Mr. Ajay Chauhan, Director, Gujarat State Aviation Infrastructure Company Limited for Regional Connectivity Scheme. We have Mr. Chauhan with us. We missed him last time. Afternoon, sir. On the behalf of Director Ajay Chauhan, uh, I would like to thank the team of Scotch for giving us the opportunity to showcase our pres presentation and uh, focus area in aviation sector in Gujarat. Thank you very much. Congratulations to you. The next one also goes to Mr. Ajay Chauhan, Director, as the Civil Aviation Department, Government of Gujarat, for good sake. Thank you very much again, once again, for giving us the opportunity. And we are trying our level best to provide the basic in aviation infrastructure facility to the state uh, to provide more and more connectivity in all mode of transportation through helicopter to air cargo services and uh, we hope we will be the best in this sector at least in our country congratulations thank you very much mr venu ganapuram principal scientist csir national aerospace laboratories for g1 yeah good afternoon all of you uh, thank you so much, Scorch and the panelists for choosing me here. So, some panelists for me. Yes, CSR is well uh, talked about it and being practiced, but I believe in ISR, that is individualistic social responsibility. And that's what I did in saving lives of doctors during beginning of pandemic, that is April, May 2020, when uh, Vaccines development or mutation was not available, and this is purely individualistic and personal project. And I could deliver this for an individual social responsibility. Thank you so much for choosing. Congratulations, Mrs. Sujana Bodapalli, Assistant Environmental Engineer from Amada Lavas. Uh, Lava Lassa Municipality, conversion of open defecation area into. Hey, please. Okay, sir. Mr. B. Sridhar, Chairman and Managing Director, Andhra Pradesh Powered Transmission Corporation Limited for AP Transco Network Maintenance and Monitoring Information System. Good afternoon, sir. On behalf of uh, AP Transco, uh, the Texas First Group uh, for developing AP Transco has passed the order of and also for the cutting system studies, uh, the uh, process is very simple and very efficiently they can uh, perform the duties. Similarly, uh, by integrating the uh, real-time data data with GIS, our uh, LDC and SRLDC are able to find the information. And also, we have that for the development of the project and the underpassing project progress. And it is also a good thing. Congratulations. The next one also goes to Andhra Pradesh Power Transmission Corporation Limited. Okay. Santosha Rao, Chairman and Managing Director, Andhra Pradesh, Southern Power Distribution Company, for Robot Technology and Customers. Good afternoon to all. Good afternoon. Uh, this is uh, Suva Prasad Reddy, Director of Projects and IT. He is speaking on behalf of our CMD. Our CMD is known as APR's public hearing at Vaijar. So thank you, thank you. I am delighted to be part of this Scotch Award. This is RoboCall. It is a facility provided to all electricity consumers in the Southern Power Distribution Area. So as to ensure that is the quality disposal of the concern. This is the thing we are implementing successfully. This 1912 is an online, not only is a calling app, we are connecting all our uh, section offices, uh, around 1900 locations, our sections and substations, everything is we are able to connect to this uh, 1912 facility. We are still in the process of improvising it. Thank you, thank you one and all. And definitely this AP is uh, 
एसपीडी सेल इज कनेक्टिंग द ऑल द सबस्टेशंस एंड दे आर नियरली नियरली 10000 आवर एम्प्लॉइज आर कनेक्टेड विद आवर मोबाइल ऐप एप्लीकेशन दे आर थरोली वेरीफाइंग ऑन स्पॉट स्टेटस ऑफ द कंप्लेंट एंड इमीडिएटली दे आर अटेंडिंग एंड दे आर गिविंग फीडबैक टू द सेंटर सो आई हैज टू रिजॉल्व द ऑल ग्रीवेंसेस विद इन द इन द रिजॉल्विंग टाइम एंड व्हिच इज इन टाइमली रिव्यूइंग बाय द एपीआरसी एपीआरसी इज एज पर द एसओपी फाइनेंस वेदर द ऑल ग्रीवेंसेस आर बीइंग disposed or not this aprc is also pursuing and penalizing the discount for any default so that is the system we are following that is automatic penalty also we are paying for the consumers for our default services if any so that way we are in a better position in resolving the all concerns of our the customers to the best satisfaction and also we are this robo call facility is ensuring that also that system is ensuring whether we are at disposal is as per the as per the visualized data we are disposing it and the aprc also monitoring yeah, and yeah. penalizing the discount if any fault in the service levels rendered to the consumer that's all thank you thank you sir congratulations mr sabbi siva ramakrishna municipal commissioner from bhimavaram municipality housing for all under pmay siva ramakrishna the next one also goes to bhimavaram municipality e parichay Mr. Sataru Srinivasa Rao, Municipal Commissioner from Bobili Municipality, Sanitation and Septage Management. Sir, uh, Sivaram Krishna Sabhi Sir from Bihar Municipality, Andhra Pradesh. Yes, Mr. Sivaram Krishna. Housing sir. for all under PMAY for you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And one more, that is E Pariche. Bhimavar yes, sir. Municipality. Yes, sir. Sir, right now previously I worked as a Tadpatri Commissioner, sir. Right now I am in West Bengal District, New District form, sir. So the district headquarters, Rashwadari, is submitting uh, these two nominations, sir. New Parche and uh, Housing for All, sir. And uh, we are uh, nearly uh, sixteen thousand uh, uh, beneficiaries. Uh, we are constructing here in both uh, uh, two types, sir. One is for uh, uh, already built up uh, houses, sir. That is a Tico housing system. And the other one is uh, one cent site is uh, allotted and. Uh, housing unit was constructed by housing corporation both are nearly 16000 families uh, got the benefit sir under this uh, scheme sir and uh, including this e purchase we introducing all the it's a paperless office sir right now all the correspondence uh, from government or uh, from uh, citizen grievances or uh, public uh, grievances or uh, through online sir it's a paperless and it's a time bound and transparent and uh, accountable uh, uh, work we are doing here sir Uh, we are uh, very much thankful to the uh, Scotch group, sir. Uh, now this is the my nearly I got uh, this uh, 49th, I think so, sir. Award uh, from uh, the different most part is very worked. I submit the uh, 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 different types of projects. All are, uh, are recognized by services, and very much thankful to you, sir. And it's very encouraging me to do more work uh, in future with equitable and transparent, sir. Thank you very much, sir. I'm sure you have done such wonderful work wherever you have been, you know, you know, and repeatedly you have been on Scotch platform. Your work has been looked at. Keep up the good work and love to keep interacting. Congratulations! Thank you, thank you, Arvind sir. Municipal Commissioner Mr. Sataru Srinivasa Rao from Bobili Municipality. With us, Chandigarh Renewable Energy and Science and Technology Promotion Society, Mr. Devendra Dalai. Sir, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, everybody. So thank you very much, the organizers. This is Devendra Dalai, Chief Executive Officer of uh, Chandigarh Renewable Energy Science and Technology Promotion Society. Uh, this project is a very unique uh, project. As you all know, that Chandigarh is fast developing as a clean, green, and a smart city. And rooftop solar, we are very aggressively promoting rooftop solar because of the land constraints here in Chandigarh is only 114 square kilometer area. So whatever rooftop is available, we are trying to tap the entire rooftop of the city. and this is a very unique project because this uh, project has been installed in a land neutral uh, place that is a lake which is a uh, perennial lake uh, over that we have put this uh, floating solar and besides uh, generating almost like 7 lakhs uh, of unit of power from this 500 kilowatt of uh, uh, solar power project we have installed three very beautiful uh, fountains also so it beautifies the entire uh, uh, lake area where people they go for the walking for the morning and evening and lot of tourists also they go there uh, so this fountain also beautifies the place but besides that this uh, electricity generation also uh, 
it helps in uh, offsetting the uh, electricity demand of the entire forest department of uh, chandigarh administration uh, and uh, this uh, because of this floating uh, solar and as well as the uh, the fountains uh, what you do actually the, it generates not only the more electricity it reduces the evaporation reduction also um, on the water body so taking uh, uh, taking clue from this project we have installed another project of 2 megawatt which was the foundation stone was laid by our honorable president of india and the the project is going to be inaugurated in another 2 3 days time this is going to be another interesting project this is north india's largest uh, floating uh, solar project so this is what we wanted to showcase this is a unique project so that we can now uh, harness solar energy for producing green energy thank you very much has this uh, already been operational all this 500 uh, uh, it is it, it, it is already operational both the both the project this one 500 kilowatt is already operational in danastek and taking experience from this we have installed another one which has been installed in a record time of just 2 months time by 31st of december it is already commissioned and operational both the projects are operational now mr r kirlosh kumar managing director chennai metropolitan water supply and sewerage board sustainable water source augmenting augmentation circular water economy so good evening sir this is asian the executive engineer from chennai metropolitan water supply board i thank uh, the staff team for awarding us uh, for this critical project on behalf of our managing director and uh, chennai metropolitan water supply this is an important work we have done in the sector water economy and the real life also we have to this project thank you congratulations mr alok kachiar chief executive officer chatisgarh state renewable energy development agency tor sujala scheme so i am sanjeev jain chief engineer the chatisgarh renewable energy development agency my ceo kachiar sahab is in meeting he is in some meeting he could not uh, come to this event <coughs> on behalf of chatisgarh renewable energy development agency i would like to thanks uh, to the scost team for the recognition of this uh, intervention in the states for under this scheme we have installed the solar photovoltaic pump uh, under the arrangement when there there is no electricity and this has created a lot of change in the livelihood of the farmers rural farmers so far in the last 6 years we could have installed more than 120000 pumps in the states and i would like to mention that the highest pump installed everywhere in india and they, the kusum scheme for the component pradhan mantri scheme the application of the system and we are we, we have we are trying to cover the entire state with the solar photovoltaic power plant for the improvement of their livelihood and for the irrigation system thank you sir dr j aruna municipal commissioner chittur municipal corporation for waste to green justice s h shastri chairman Delhi Electricity Regulatory Commission Energy Efficiency Prime Mover of Energy Independence yet another one for Delhi Electricity Regulatory Commission for alternative dispute resolution measures for consumer under Electricity Act 2003 Mr H Dinesham Director Department of Panchayats Government of Kerala Integrated Local Governance Management System Urban Governance and to when online building a approval, plan approval from directorate of municipal administration government of tamil nadu uh, good afternoon director uh, good afternoon i am gopal akshan deputy director representing our director uh, sir ponaya uh, thank you for selecting for uh, semi finals uh, we are doing the end to end online process uh, for the building approval which contributes ease of doing business we also stood in the second rank uh, in all over india Uh, that is our guidance uh, department uh, further we are in the process of integrating with all other uh, nmc departments to integrate with them to our system to further uh, to supporting the ease of doing business thank you for uh, uh, awarding us thank you very much congratulations ms neha sharma director directorate of urban local bodies government of uttar pradesh for e vetan a listed transformation of schools education department greater chennai corporation sir gagandeep singh bedi commissioner good afternoon uh, i am sneha here uh, the deputy commissioner of education i am representing the commissioner of greater chennai corporation 
level with and on behalf of the Greater Chennai Corporation and the entire team, I thank you for uh, considering us for the Scots Order of Merit for our holistic transformation of school project. Thank you. Congratulations. Full fledged digital substation, Gujarat Energy Transmission Corporation, Mr. Upendra Pandey, Managing Director. Good afternoon. Thank you, Scotch Group, for giving this opportunity to join at this level. It's a matter of really great pride for us to reach to this level, prestigious one for us. JETCO has adopted digitalization to substation technology right in the year 2012 at Bay level. And now we have full fledged digital substation uh, in our system at Sevalia. All substation functionalities are through high speed optical fiber communication network. It is a very innovative, unique and extraordinary feature. It has got some special features like fail proof tripping. It has added redundancy and flexibility with unique feature of automated switching over to alternate merging unit for sampling. It has simplified control and protection panels. It provides enhanced safety and high intelligent intelligence to the substation. Thank you. Thank you for choosing us for this level. Congratulations once again. I now invite Mr. M. Prasanna Kumar, Managing Director, Gujarat State Electricity Corporation, Building from the 5S Workplace Management System, Rainwater Harvesting, Hyderabad Metropolitan Water Supply and Sewerage Board, Mr. Dana Kishore, Managing Director. Thank you very much. Mr. Kishore, we'll have to move on to the next announcement, please. We are not able to hear you at all. Thank you very much for being with us and congratulations to you and the entire team. Now, now I invite Mr. K. Ramesh, Municipal Commissioner, Kakinara Municipal Corporation for Virtual and Digital Classrooms. Mr. A. Bhargav Teja, Municipal Commissioner in Kurnool Municipal Corporation, Wet Waste to Organic Fertilizer. Mr. E. V. Ramana Babu, Municipal Commissioner, Clean Macher Macherla, Green Macherla, Macherla Municipality. Sir, good evening, sir. Good evening. Sir, good evening. It's a great to meet you. My name is E.V. Ramanababu, working as Municipal Commissioner, Macharla, Panna District, Andhra Pradesh, sir. On behalf of my staff and citizens of Macharla Municipality, I am here to extend my vote of thanks to all jury members and panel members, mentors and co-participants for gracing me this opportunity and your valuable time, sir. We have succeeded in changing the face of Macharla municipality by clean Macharla and green Macharla, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Mr. Dinesh Vagmare, Chairman and Managing Director, Maharashtra State Electricity Transmission Company Limited for utilization of drones for EHV line patrolling. Mr. Praveen Kumar, Commissioner and Director. Implementation of finance module under e-municipal ERP, Municipal Administration and Urban Development Department. Thank you. Thank you all the Scotch team. On behalf of our CDMA, Mr. Sri, uh, Mr. Praveen Kumar, I am speaking. Uh, our finance, mo finance module under municipal e-municipal ERP is a unique module which is being implemented in all ULBs, duly capturing the receipts and expenditure online. Uh, when, uh, immediately, which is enabling us to prepare financial statements and to meet all the reforms. Thank you for choosing the this module. Congratulations. Next one also goes to Mr. Praveen Kumar for capital value system in levy of property tax by adopting flow rates. Thank you once again. And and urban Development Department, Andhra Pradesh. Thank, thank you once again. On behalf of our CDMA, uh, actually, the Andhra Pradesh is the uh, uni, uh, the state which had implemented in all ULB this capital value method of taxation basing on the guideline values of the registration department as per the FRBM reforms as well as the 15th Finance Commission reforms. And we have successfully implemented and our revenue has been raised uh, from 1 for 2021. We had implemented this, the, this system. And uh, there is a very much increase in our revenues also. And uh, the best feature is every year, basing on the guideline values, we could able to rise our revenues to meet the increasing expenditure of the ULBs. Thank you once again for choosing our Congratulations. Thank you. Municipal Corporation Uluru, 
the juvenation of krishna iluru kanal mr shahid shaik municipal commissioner the next one also goes to municipal corporation iluru transformation and beautification of garbage vulnerable points mr shaik municipal commissioner mr k venkata rami reddy municipal commissioner from nagari municipality environment sanitation narsi patnam municipality mr nama k rao municipal commissioner solid and liquid waste management northern power distribution company of telangana mr a gopal rao chairman and managing director irda gprs enabled integrated spot billing good afternoon this is uh, gopal rao cmd npdcl varangal we have introduced irda gprs enabled integrated spot billing by which uh, we are able to achieve a 100% billing where removing the human interference in billing bring down the errors in billing reduce bill related complaints enabling automatic updating of consumer ledger of discom this is uh, facilities online bill payment through net banking credit and debit card these are the benefits another benefits of the irda enabled integrated spot billing is elimination of errors in meter reading leading to improvement in revenue and um, reducing the consumer complaints this is more, one of the most important thing is reducing the consumer complaints drastic reduction in bill related complaints after the introduction of irda metering the error in billing which used to previously range between 10 to 15% has been eliminated really enabling automatic updating of consumer ledger of discom facilitating consumers for payment through net banking and credit debit card 88.52% of the total metered consumers are provided billing with gprs enabled irda metering this is really a, a giving very good results 37.86 lakh consumers are provided monthly bills under gprs enabled integrated spot billing so consumers are given a bills immediately and sms also sent to consumers automation of capturing the consumption information and bill generation through use of ir based communication so contactless billing with 100% success rate real time data transfer elimination of errors in billing and zero disputes ensuring uniformity in billing cycle thereby benefit of billing slab for consumers cost effective irda enabled integrated spot billing the cost effectiveness of the project procurement of gprs enabled integrated spot billing is one time capital investment and gprs stream card cost that is the only expenditure cost of single phase irda meter is rupees 800 and three phase irda meter is 2200 approximately which is substantially lower than smart meter which offers similar benefits and accurate meter reading without manual intervention so the average cost of the bill in inr2 inr4 as compared to typically inr6 and inr10 for other billing methods so this is how we are improving the billing and we are also improving the revenues of the uh, utility so congratulations this- mr rao Thank you very much for having me. Thank, Thank you. 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 Thank the solar power generated is to be distributed to various places in the state at longer distances <coughs> to avoid all these things what we made is it has been distributed over all the telangana state in almost all the districts as a result we have reduced the length of line we have reduced the losses we have improved the voltage levels as a result we are able to get a very good uh, result in a uh, distributed uh, power generation as it is we are getting a very good uh, solar power as you all know we are a, basically agriculture is the consumption to the extent of 30 to 40% uh, 
and that too daytime we are getting a most of the solar power generator out of the 3754 megawatt generation uh, installed capacity we are able to feed the agriculture consumers to the extent of all the uh, agriculture is 24 hours per day throughout the uh, year this is at uh, free freely we are supplying agricultural consumers power for 24 by 7 hours using all this in spite of this we are also going for the rooftop uh, solar energy that is also very very congratulations this is how in our next thank, panel, thank you. Thank we will you. have an opportunity to uh, interact with you on these matters and try to understand them more. Thank you very much. So thank this you. is how we are prospering in Telangana state. Uh, especially in the electricity ordinary, we are much, much ahead. And our per capita consumption has also gone up like anything. Even we have topped the entire country. This is how our Honorable Chief Minister vision has been successful in LXD and in feeding the agriculture, not only agriculture, all the all type of consumers are very, very happy under the uh, Thank you very much. Thank you very much for sharing the rule of now we'll have to move on. on. Thank you so much. We will interact with you soon. Mm -hmm. I now invite Dr. Akanksha Bhaskar, Joint Secretary, Government of West Bengal, Panchayats and Rural Development Department, Bangla, Para, Baithak under GPDP. So JJ Gandhi, Chief Engineer, Pashim Gujarat, which company? AMR of LT Industrial Consumers. Ramachandra Puram Municipality, Mr. Kusum Srikanth Reddy, Municipal Commissioner, Upgradation of Food Infrastructure through implementation of Manabadi Nadu Nidu Program. Dr. Sandeep Rathor, Special Secretary, Rural Development Department, Government of Tripura, Pradhan Mantri, Avas Yojana Grameen, Development of Integrated Municipal Solid Waste Management System for Urban and Industrial Areas, Silvasa Municipal Council, Dr. Sunab Singh, Chief Officer, Dr. G. Raghu Ma Reddy, Chairman and Managing Director, Southern Power Distribution Company of Telangana, Performance Improvement Measures, Online Consumer Services, Southern Power Distribution Company of Telangana, Mr. G. Raghumar Reddy, CMD, Operational Efficiency Improvement Measures, Southern Power Distribution Company of Telangana, Mr. G. Raghumar Reddy once again, State Institute of Rural Development and Panchayati Raj, Tamil Nadu, Capacity Building of Panchayati Raj Elected Representatives, Ms. S. Devanyati, Director. It's a very good afternoon. And uh, we are from Tamil Nadu, the State Institute of Rural Development. Uh, we are uh, making a capacity building of the Panjayat Raj institutions from the state level, district level, and the block level and the Panjayat level. Whatever uh, the newly elected persons, wherever they are, we accustom them entirely, handhold them in their business, and also in the all the Panjayat Raj and the rural development scheme. We have an entire team and a very good video uh, lab here, which will cover approximately 1,19,000 people across the state. So we have very well handled them and we are in the progress and updating all the uh, better developments that are happening there. Thank you. Congratulations. State Urban Development Agency, Uttar Pradesh, Pradhan Mantri Awas Yojana Urban, Yashu Rustagi, Director. Pranamantri Avas Yojana, State Urban Development Agency, Uttar Pradesh. Yet another one for State Urban Development Agency, UP, PM Street Vendor, Atman Pratidhi, Mr. Nirmal Raj James Alexander, Chief Community Development Officer for Project Livelihood, Tamil Nadu Urban Habitat Development Board. Good evening to you all. Excuse me, it's a pleasure to represent RMD of the Tamil Nadu Urban Habitat Development Board. We work for the development of the urban poor from the objectionable areas and through this livelihood and this education support, we give them preference to come up with their life with better livelihood education and uh, education support under the scholarship. Under the CSR programs, we help them to come up in life right from their higher education. And we have a follow with them, we motivate them so that their life 
have a better life and future and we thank the sports team for selecting us which will motivate, motivate us to do further more and achieve our motto of the board God we shall see the smile of the board. Thank you all. Congratulations. Next one also goes to Tamil Nadu Urban Habitat Development Board for education support. Thank you all for selecting the second one also. This is as the families are researching from different places, we provide them the skill. So this is the education support. Yeah, with education support, the last one we give the skill training also because we think education is the best investment uh, that India can make. So when these people have a better education, they will have a better outlook of life and better attitude and they will contribute more to the development of the country. So we thank once again the Scots team for selecting us and with this encouragement we will further march towards the development of the urban tour. Thank you. Congratulations once again. Community Municipality Commissioner Mr. BJSP Raju, Nature Friendly Composting Methods in Urban Areas. Mr. Dharmendra Pratap Singh, Mission Director. Urban Development Department, Government of Uttar Pradesh, Smart City Central Digital Monitoring Center. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, this project, the Smart City Central Digital Monitoring System, is the unique project uh, which connects all 16 municipal corporations of uh, Uttar Pradesh. Uh, their control and command centers are connected at one place in the Uttar Pradesh, uh, Lucknow. And uh, by this system, we are monitoring and uh, controlling many municipal services, environmental pollution and traffic on different parameters. And this is very useful to evaluate municipal services and other services. I am extending my thanks to Scotch for recognizing our efforts. Thank you so much. Congratulations. LT Spacer Provisions, Uttar Gujarat, which company limited? Mr. V. M. Shroff, Chief Engineer, Uttar Gujarat, which company limited? Uh, thanks, Scott organizer, for providing uh, opportunity to uh, opportunity for interaction. UGVCL has installed spacer on electrical LT line for the uh, reduction of LT line accidents and making the LT line network more robust. Uh, with the installation of LT line spacer on overhead line in urban area, rural area and agricultural land, uh, we have achieved zero accident uh, goal uh, uh, because of snapping of conductor and leakage uh, current incident. Further, in our agriculture area, uh, because of LT line sparking, uh, there are probe burning issues are arriving. So we have controlled this problem also by installation of LT spacer. And further, uh, we have protected our transformer failure, burning of LTPC cable and LT line uh, failure in that area. Uh, we have achieved uh, zero uh, accident uh, spacer installation LT line area during this financial year. And we have installed uh, 73,000 kilometers LT line uh, with spacers. Uh, at uh, uh, more than 1.4 lakh locations with an uh, annual saving of 68 lakh. Uh, thank you, Scott Organizer. Thank you so much for being with us and congratulations to you in the entire Wazandu Kuttawam project. It's Wazandu Kuttawam project. Uh, good evening, all. Uh, on behalf of uh, Divideshni, ma'am, I'm representing. My name is Satish Kumar, Associate Chief Operating Officer, MIS. Uh, thank you so much for the opportunity given by this uh, Scotch and uh, we are developing this uh, project for the all the Gautam project Tamil Nadu Rural Transformation. It's purely of uh, MGP grant online MAS portal. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Mr. R. Sri Ramulu Naidu, Municipal Commissioner, Vizianagara Municipal Corporation for e-governance at doorstep through village and wards, ward secretariats. Thank you so much, sir. May I, may I audible, sir? Yes, you are. Yes. Thank you so much, uh, the entire jury, uh, jury and the panel members for selecting the municipal corporation of Vijayanagaram uh, for the e-governance at the doorstep. Yes, 
Actually, this is the one of the most important and unique uh, idea, idea introduced by the beloved Chief Minister Vice Jagat Mohan Reddy after issuing the charge in Andhra Pradesh. Here in the village, uh, every thousand households there is a secretariat. Each secretariat having a ten specialist direct equity employees. Each one is working in a separate uh, streams, just like agriculture, education, health. and uh, uh, are different kinds of municipal services and everything so this is the one of the best model in the country we are able to whatever the government expected from the ward and village secretariats everything is going on in expected level so uh, we are very happy to uh, inform you that uh, not only the service delivery system the governance in the governance also the grievance mechanism system and uh, citizen feedback system whatever the services rendered by the municipality or the panchayati raj again the government check the uh, satisfaction level of the citizens after delivering the services this kind of the beautiful system is working in uh, uh, andhra pradesh because of this uh, uh, we are very thankful to you sir and the entire jury members for uh, giving us such a great opportunity so congratulations once again excuse me sir this is from ap transco sir APSLDC, AP Transco, APSLDC, sir. Regarding uh, forecast model we have developed, uh, regarding that I want to say a few words, sir. L- load demand forecast, sir. APSLDC, Andhra Pradesh State Load Dispatch Center, sir. We have developed. Uh, first of all, uh, let me on behalf of APSLDC, uh, we convey heartful thanks to Scotch, sir, for the merit order, sir. Actually, we have developed in-house. Uh, uh developed electricity power demand forecasting model sir using artificial intelligence and machine learning sir mm-hmm. this is actually enabling us to make right decisions on electricity demand and supply management of grid and minimizing power purchase cost also sir our state government policy is to ensure 24 hours uninterrupted uh, supply at the least cost power supply sir to the consumers the developed forecast tool uh, tool is helping us to manage ap state grid supply and demand to maintain grid discipline and also it is very much helpful in purchasing cost effective power sir and ultimately it is benefiting the consumer sir so we are able to forecast our demand day ahead and we are in the process of implementing the same in the intraday sir in the within the day also sir so this tool is the first of its kind in uh, india developed by apsldc sir this is the project you've been talking about power demand forecasting using ai and ml yes sir yes sir This is power demand, power demand forecasting using artificial intelligence and machine learning. Mm-hmm. See, this is a in-house developed by our own team for APSC. It is the first of its kind in uh, India, sir. We are uh, forecasting here. They had the load so that we can uh, balance the generation and load so that we can have eliminate the uh, penalties, deviation uh, settlement mechanism, and also we are able to manage the grid. Uh, Within the discipline uh, code of uh, uh, grid code, sir. Mm-hmm. So and also we are able to procure power at the cheaper rate. So ultimately the benefit goes to the consumer, sir. So also we are able to kind of curtail load reliefs at the immediate uh, uh, curtailment of uh, uh, power to consumers also, sir. So mm-hmm. this is very much helpful to uh, AP grid, sir, and also to the consumer also. We are able to contain. Uh, the I mean uh, to procure the power in the mm-hmm. dead market and the same day market uh, at the optimum rate uh, at the least cost, sir. Thank you, sir. Congratulations, many many congratulations to you, ladies and gentlemen. This brings us to the end of the announcement of Scotch semi-finalist order of merit for the current round.